about that, Michelle. Oh, that's a nice intro. Thank you for that, from one dynamic woman to another. I'll take that. Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen and friends of the Lab School. I am Muriel Bowser, a friend of the Lab School. And I am very proud to uh, be the eighth mayor of the District of Columbia upon my swearing in on January 2nd. I want to acknowledge all the hard-working parents and friends of LAB who come together to make sure that the school has the resources that it needs. I want to acknowledge and thank my friends Ben and Lori Soto for always keeping me up to date on what's happening at LAB. I want to also congratulate all of the folks who are being acknowledged here tonight, my friend Congressman Cummings, Mr. Richard Ford, Mr. Vin Roberti, Ms. Karina Smirnoff, and Jacqueline Mason. Um, they are definitely worthy of our praise, demonstrating to our children and families people in government, policymakers, and funders, how important it is to have great examples for our children. I'm just coming off a 20-month campaign trail, and what I learned in those 20 months across all eight wards of our city is that people love the progress that we're making in Washington, but they're also focused on how we can include more people in that progress. Schools and how we make our school choices better in the District of Columbia remains at the top of my list. Our public schools, our public charter schools, and our independent schools must work in the District of Columbia. So I am, um, if we are to continue to attract wonderful families, and we are, the next 25 years, 150,000 more people will call Washington home. If we're going to continue to attract new businesses and jobs for D.C. residents, our school choices have to work. I have the opportunity to preside over um, our public schools and to influence policies for our public charter schools and funding, but to also make the environment right for our independent schools to work. I'm committed to making sure no matter a child's learning style or learning way or how a child learns, he or she, no matter where he or she lives in the District of Columbia, has to have access to a school that serves that child's needs, and that's my commitment. I'll continue to be a friend of LAB, and I know LAB will continue to keep me posted. God bless you all, and have a wonderful evening.